Oh, someone said L purge plot leak. You didn't like the plot? Okay, let's go over this. So the purge sounds like it was going to be a wild movie. And I say was because there's some talk about why it's not going to happen. So, okay, this came out today uh, from Collider. We'll go into it. It says uh, where the purge six will revamp America into states based on ideology, sex and religion. The exact quote that they were talking about with this movie is that, okay, if you remember in the last Purge movie, it ended, which I actually liked. I didn't think it was that bad, where, you know, the states go into chaos. They, they're about to end the Purge, and the U.S. citizens there don't want it to end. So they just revolt, and it becomes the Purge every day. And the movie was a race to get to Mexico, which is ironic, you know, racing for freedom to go to Mexico when a lot of people come here for the freedom, like I did as a baby. And so I, I actually quite enjoyed the last Purge movie, but it ends with the whole U.S. going Purge 24-7. It's like a apocalyptic wasteland of just crime everywhere all the time. And Purge 6 was going to explore that idea further, where they said each state was going to be divided up based on what your ideologies, your sexuality, or race were. So here they said you were going to have your black state your gay state, your white ev evangelical state, and it's really a broken country. I think that is a wild thing. And I don't know if I, I love that idea or not. Like, what would you call the, which one would be the black state? I don't, I don't want to make assumptions on what I think the black state would be. Like, would it just be the state where there's predominantly black people there? So you would just automatically make that the black state? And who, which state do you make the gay state? Like, I, I can't even think in my mind. Oh, California. That's the one. No, maybe New York. Oh, Wyoming. Let's make Wyoming the one. Like, <laughs> how do you do that? And what if you're black and gay? What state do you go to then? Do you have to pick a side? Is it, uh, you know, a divorce situation where you spend the weekends in the gay state and then your weekdays in the black state and they let you cross over? Do you get a passport? These are the questions I want to know about with the Purge 6. So... That is a crazy idea I'm seeing. Oh, someone said Ohio. Oh, I don't even know what Ohio would be. There's no Ohio where they have the Mormons. So I would I would feel like that would be the religious state where you're just, you know, crazy religious. You go there. Florida is unstoppable. You're right. If you <laughs> Florida would be the state that it goes against all the other states. Now, Texas, hey, as a Texas man myself, we'd hold ourselves pretty strong. I'll tell you that. But there was a problem going on because uh, the producers of the Perch 6 say, doesn't look like the movie will be happening. So here's an article that popped up where he says the purge six in doubt because the studio is scared said creators. Now, if you just heard me describe this plot and the weird things it was trying to pull off with dividing States based on race, religion, and how in this time we live in where people are sensitive, you know, everything offends everybody and whatnot, you know, sometimes for good reason or whatnot, that'd probably not be the smartest idea to make it. And you think that's why the studio is scared. They don't want to make a movie where they say, this is the black state. This is the gay state. This is the Mexican state. And this is the state where you collect Funko Pops. That's where I would be staying during the purge wars. Uh, it turns out the movie just looks to be way too expensive. So here it says, um, all right, let me zoom in. Okay. So it says, I wrote the script. Universal has seen it. They're concerned about budget, but it definitely presents a fractured America. The America I present in Purge 6 is where we all separated by ideologies and sexual preferences. So the states are broken down in different ways. It's written. It's in Universal's hands. I think they're scared about the budget. But the thing is, but the thing was, if I was going to come back and direct a sixth one, it was going to be something bigger and a little bit more epic in scope. With the new America, I want to present and bring back Frank Grillo. That's smart. I love Frank Grillo in the Purge movies. Uh, so it's kind of in limbo. So it's not really that the studio is scared with that wild idea of a premise. It's just that it's just too ambitious of an idea. These are Blumhouse, you know, low budget, scary movies. They make these for like 10, 15 million dollars max. What you're talking about here would probably be 30, 40 million if you're going to show us different states, cross country, all the big national war and whatnot, which would be awesome. It would be like a great step for the Purge franchise. Like think about the Jurassic World where we went from a dinosaur park to then by the last movie where just like dinosaurs everywhere. Same situation here. Purge one day to purge 24-7 all over the U.S. That feels like a cool progression. Uh, but I guess it's just too expensive for them. We'll see if it happens. I like the idea, especially if they're bringing Frank Grillo back. 
I imagine there's going to be like a cross country thing. So maybe Frank Grillo starts off like in New York, has to transport some people to Mexico. So he goes through all these different states and we see all these different ideologies throughout the movie. At least that's how I imagine it would go down. But yeah, they're going to say woke purge. <laughs> Damn, purge six is going to get some controversy. <laughs> yeah, it, it definitely uh, Jurassic World Dominion was terrible. Yeah, it wasn't great. I agree. Um, but that, I don't think it was that crazy. Like I like the direction. It really is depending on the execution. Cause that could go south so freaking fast, but we'll see if we'll get another purge movie. You know, Blumhouse loves making this kind of stuff. We might get it someday, but that's what's going on. Wild plot. And they're scared about the budget. My friends.